Here we are at the EVA meeting 2022 in Greece, and I'm speaking to Professor Maurizio Galliani about the Empath Project. And I wonder, Maurizio, can you tell me what the Empath Project is? Uh, well, thank you for uh, the question. Uh, the Empath Project is a European project, and uh, it involves eight different universities, including the University of Patras, where we are now, and the University of Milano, which is my institution. And then there is the University of Bari, also in Italy, two universities in the Netherlands, Maastricht and uh, Amsterdam. And then we have uh, uh, the Charles University in Prague and uh, Slovenia in Ljubljana, and Barcelona with Dr. Ribeas, who is also uh, present at this meeting. Uh, it is funded by the European Union through the uh, Erasmus Plus project. And basically it uh, uh, is uh, dedicated to develop in a selected uh, uh, number of uh, uh, nephrology fellows, uh, interventional nephrology uh, abilities. Uh, there are four models, the first one, uh, which was carried out uh, last year was on kidney biopsy. And we are exactly now in the moment where we are dealing with vascular access. It's called the REVAC module of the NPATH project. Uh, and, uh, and then we will have another module on ultrasound in kidney patient and on peritoneal dialysis. So going back to vascular access, uh, the concept of end part is blending uh, uh, traditional learning, online learning and in-presence learning with hands-on training. So uh, all the fellows will travel to the eight institutions that are part of the project and they uh, will do hands-on training in those universities. And they will also have the possibility to bond, to make a group of young individuals that uh, basically will be able to develop interventional nephrology in the future. Okay, and there's a number of um, NPATH fellows here at this meeting today, I believe. What do they hope to gain from this meeting, do you think? Well, uh, first, uh, I think that uh, uh, the idea of the EVA meeting organizer to invite them was absolutely excellent. And uh, we at NPATH were very glad of this because... Uh, they can uh, get together again, which is a very important part of the project. And they are also exposed to a um, cutting edge meeting on vascular access, which is uh, something that they don't get in the uh, curriculum of the NPAT project. And in fact, today, uh, I personally also heard several new uh, um, concepts and, uh, and data on vascular access. So I think they will gain a lot in terms of uh, getting into contact uh, with uh, a cutting edge uh, uh, communication of uh, uh, science in vascular access. So we get a lot from these meetings in terms of theory, but how will the fellows get more experience in terms of hands-on interventional nephrology? Well, in some meetings like this, there are practical sessions. And uh, so anytime you go to a meeting, you have this uh, uh, possibility. Uh, here, I think uh, uh, one of the uh, possible uh, good things that they can get is connecting with other uh, specialists. So make, getting into contact with uh, interventional radiologists and surgeons uh, so that they will be able in their own uh, institutions maybe to uh, start uh, um, more hands-on training at their own uh, place. I think it's a great project and thank you for telling us about it. I look forward to hearing from some of the fellows as well to see what their experience is in terms of going forward with this.